Welcome to CBS This Morning. We begin with dramatic video highlighting the often terrible risks of human trafficking. A suspected smuggling vessel packed with people ran aground yesterday near San Diego. More than two dozen suspected migrants were aboard the 40-foot boat and four people died. Rescuers acted quickly to save some of the passengers from downing, drowning. Lilia Luciano is in San Diego outside one of the eight hospitals treating the injured. Lilia, good morning. Good morning to you, Anthony. 27 people were taken to area hospitals like this one with a wide variety of injuries, including hypothermia from the frigid water. Border Patrol say they believe this was a human smuggling incident and that cases like this are on the rise dramatically. They also say the boat's captain is in custody. This is all that's left of the 40-foot cabin cruiser after it crashed into a reef and broke apart Sunday morning. Ship kind of capsized. We saw people jumping in. Off-duty Navy sailor Cale Foy happened to be nearby with his family and says his military training kicked in when he jumped in the water to help. We pulled everybody that we could, uh, whether conscious or unconscious. Okay. Everyone was panicking. Everyone was yelling. Uh, no one spoke any English. Oh. Brittany Kokenderfer shot this video of the boat shortly after it capsized. You can see at least one person attempting to flee the vessel by jumping ship. We were trying to yell and all the people on the shore were like, jump off, jump off. You know, you got to get out of that boat. Multiple agencies responded to aid the wounded, not only pulling victims from the water, but conducting a cliff rescue as well. Uh, there are people in the water drowning. Uh, getting sucked out the rip current there. Uh, there's people on shore. And the reports were CPR in progress down below with multiple people injured. Uh, this was a mass rescue operation that turned into a mass casualty incident. A Border Patrol official says there's every indication that this was a smuggling vessel. Apprehensions of those crossing the border illegally by sea were up more than 90% last year. And officials say they're seeing a similar increase this year as well. Brittany says she wanted to record what was happening in case they were undocumented migrants. People are really risking their lives to come into this country and we just wanted to advocate that that shouldn't be happening. Brittany told me she posted this video in an effort to raise awareness about the importance of human rights and the need for immigration reform. If the people on the boat are in fact undocumented, it's still unclear how enforcement, law enforcement will act and how quickly. Officials did say that the boat was different and bigger than what's usually used for human smuggling, perhaps in an effort to avoid being detected. Gail. Mm, thank you very much, Lilia.